Now there's a name that's well known if you've dealt with turbocharging at all, especially in trucks, Gail Banks. Now he's entering the marine market with a Duramax-based diesel that puts out up to 575 horsepower. Of course, you know Gail. He's a turbocharging genius, and what a job they've done with this. I caught up with Gail Banks as he explained this engine. About five years ago, GM asked me to go back into the marine business, and what you see here today is a result of that. Uh, it's a 6.6-liter Duramax built for marine. Uh, all the mariniz marinization uh, and the engine management is all banks. We're building this engine for pleasure boats, work boats, sport fishers, uh, commercial and military or government services, pe people like to say. Uh, horsepower levels 350 to 575 in the engine you see here today. And 3,000 to 3,800 RPM is the rated range of engine speed. We also do a super turbo version uh, we're developing with the Navy that makes close to 800 horsepower. A lot more to come with this Banks, Gale Banks marine engine. Back in the 70s, 80s, early 90s, we were selling gasoline engines all over the world, twin turbo uh, Gale Banks marine uh, high performance stuff. And people wanted better fuel economy. And especially in Europe, people wanted diesel. So what we have is a lightweight V8 high fuel efficiency diesel engine. Now this particular model right here is hooked up to a stern drive, a duo prop setup, but they've hooked them up to jet drives, pod drives, whatever you'd like. Believe me, you want a lot of horsepower in a light package, be sure and check this out. 